Welcome to Tuesday Night Vespers, my friends. I'm so happy to join with you again as we calm our hearts and minds entering into this time of prayer and reflection, listening to our scriptures. As we prepare, let us take three calming breaths together. stars do shine. Tell me why the ivy twines. Tell me why the sky so blue. And I will tell you just why I love you. Because God made the stars to shine because God made the ivy twine because God made the sky so blue because God made you that's why I love you I do believe that God above created you for me to love. He picked you out from all the rest. Because God made you, I love Psalm 85. Lord, you were favorable to your land. You restored the fortunes of Jacob. You forgave the iniquity of your people. You pardoned all of their sin. You withdrew all your wrath. You turned from your hot anger. Restore us again, O God of our salvation. Put away your indignation towards us. Will you be angry with us forever? Will you prolong your anger to all generations? Will you not revive us again so that your people may rejoice in you? Show us your steadfast love, O Lord, and grant us your salvation. Let me hear what the Lord God will speak, for he will speak peace to his people, to his faithful, to those who turn to him in their hearts. Surely his salvation is at hand for those who fear him, that his glory may dwell in our land. Steadfast love and faithfulness will meet. Righteousness and peace will kiss each other. Faithfulness will spring up from the ground. Righteousness will look down from the sky. The Lord will give what is good, and our land will yield its increase. Righteousness will go before him and will make a path for his steps. Acts chapter 10, starting verse 44. When Peter was still speaking, the Holy Spirit fell on all who heard the word. The circumcised believers who had come with Peter were astounded that the gift of the Holy Spirit had been poured out even on the Gentile. For they heard them speaking in tongues and extolling God. Then Peter said, can anyone withhold the water for baptizing these people who have received the Holy Spirit just as we have? So he ordered them to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Then they invited him to stay for several days. Friends, thank you for joining me for Vespers again. I always love this time where we can listen to the word of our Lord together as we end our day and look forward to hopefully a restful night. As we close out our time together, I invite you to pray with me by repeating after me. Dear God, thank you for this day. Watch over me as I sleep and help me to be your child tomorrow. In your name I pray, amen. Good night, friends.